In this video, I'm going to share a very easy formula with you to generate all possible combination for a single column. What we need to type equal, select the data range, and percent quotation mark, pipe symbol, quotation mark, and percent, and then we use transpose function. So I will use transpose and input the same array close the bracket hit enter it will give me all possible combination in different columns we want them in a single column what we need to do click on the first cell type to column open and close the brackets hit enter and it will generate me all possible combination now the only issue we are facing in this formula they also generate a duplicate entry for us for example if we can see argentina duplicate entry australia duplicate entry and same for all other present on a list so we need to remove those duplicate and also we want to split on multiple columns so for this we use a let function so we will define a let function first and for the variable name i will just define x and the name value is my full function i will hit a comma here alt enter and now we will define text before we first want to get this argument and then we want to get after the pipe argument so we will use text before the variable name i will choose tb text before and text before function for the text i will use x because i already defined the x which is the whole array so i will just type x and the delimiter in this case is pipe i will close the bracket comma alt enter and now i will define text after so ta i will use text after function the variable name same and the separator will be same as the last time alt enter and now we will use filter function along with h stack function so if we type filter for the filter function what is the array you want to filter out so actually we want to filter out the multiple columns so i will use h stack function for the first array i will use tp for the second array i will use ta I will close the bracket and now for the include condition we will use a little bit simple logic what if i say db not equal to ta mean if the first argument is not equal to the second argument so then they will return only false other will be true now if we close the bracket for filter function and close the bracket for let function and hit enter it will only give me the unique combination and this is what we want i hope you like this full video thank you so much please subscribe the channel for more video